Look out, Storm's End! There's a new lord in town, and his name is Gendry Baratheon. Find out what that's going to do to your property taxes. Queen Cersei Pregnancy Watch, Day 59. Is the pregnancy real? Whose baby is it? Was there ever a baby? Was she ever pregnant? Was it Jamie's baby? What's going on? What camera am I looking at? Where did I go wrong? Why didn't I go to medical school? What are any of us even do- <laughs> <clears throat> Thank you. Today on Good, Good Day, Day Westeros. Westeros. in the waters at Dragonstone. And what more apt place for the mother of dragons to become the mother of... Mm, dragon? Nope. Get it? Too soon. By too soon, do you mean the joke was too soon, or the amount of time it took Danny's army to get from Winterfell down to Dragonstone? Both! It's like our little birds told us that the Northern Army was going to leave Winterfell, and then suddenly, they were in Dragonstone! Like lightning speed, which takes us to our next segment, lightning speed. Hold on, Bob, this just in from our little birds. Uh, Pert has informed me that we are actually on our next segment, weather. Well then, uh, here with the no, weather, wait. we ha I'm actually being informed that we are actually in the next section, Baking Like a Maester. Roger that. Up next on Baking Like oh, a Maester. Oh, and now we're on the next segment, Night's Watch with Lord Commander Sandy Canyon. Are you kidding me? Uh, okay, Sandy, what nope, do you have for us? Bob, this we're actually on to Cersei's Pregnancy Watch. Are you sure? I've never been so not sure of anything in my entire life. Maybe we should just stop for a second and see if we get any more ravens. Yeah. Nope, I think we're good. Okay. A royal baby is on its way, and this news has King's Landing buzzing. What do we think of baby names, Bob? Well, there aren't a lot of options in the royal bloodlines, as we've seen with the Targaryens. That family is a bunch of vowels with hair. I'm thinking maybe George, Harry, Philip. Rickon, Dickon, Clickon. How is your cousin Clickon? Archie. Archie Lannister? Weirder things have happened. And whose baby do we think it is? Well, history would say it's Jamie's. But the prophecy from Maggie the Frog said she would only have three children. Yeah, well, prophecies kind of died with the Night King. Well, in that case, who's to say there's even a baby at all? It's not like we can gauge her bump. And then this sped up timeline, how do we even know how far along she is? Or how old she is? Or how old any of us are? Speaking of which, now it's time for our segment, What the f***, Bran? What the f***? Bran is a segment where we discuss all things that make no sense about Bran Stark. Like, what the f Bran? Weren't you supposed to be able to see things? Like an entire fleet of Euron's ships? What the f Bran? Wouldn't a way for you to be strategically helpful be to warg as a raven and scout ahead and make sure there aren't, I don't know, Euron's ships about to take out your entire fleet and kill a dragon? What the f Bran? We were supposed to play Fortnite last week and you totally ghosted me! What the f What the f Yeah, I thought we were friends. Next up, we have an exclusive interview with freshly captured aide to the Queen of Dragons, Miss Sunday of Noth. Miss Sunday, great to have you with us. Good to be here, I guess. Now, Miss Sunday, we know this must be hard for you since you are now a prisoner of war in the city your queen was on her way to conquer. Yes, this is less than ideal. We understand you've seen the Whites. What are they like? Oh, the Whites are terrifying. Even the children. There are so many of them, and they've all been quite unfriendly to me ever since I got here, and they just drink all day, and nobody bathes. We are talking about the undead whites, right? Sure. Miss Sunday, what do you think will happen now that you're captured? My queen will come, as she has promised, and she will do what she can to bring me back alive. Do you think she'll succeed? I have always said that, though I hope it does not come to that, I am willing to die for my queen. And if I must die for the Queen of Dragons to sit on the Iron Throne, then that's what must happen. So you think it might come to that, that your queen may not sit on the Iron Throne? <laughs> oh my god, no! She's gonna burn you mother to the ground, and I just hope I get to sit and watch. Well, thanks for stopping by, Miss Sunday. Best of luck to you. Well, that about wraps things up for Good Day Westeros. Hopefully, we'll still be here next week. And hopefully, time won't continue to progress magically forward at a rapid pace so that maybe we don't die of old age before then. <laughs> oh, uh, and I'm just being informed that Miss Sunday of Noth is dead. Oh, what do you know? Well, till next time, remember, the night is dark. And full of terrors.